Hi everybody. Okay, so it is Thursday just before 2 30 p.m. and we are just finishing up with homeschooling she right now is on working on her art project but I want to check in because um, I posted a video yesterday about what our schedule is gonna look like for the month of January and I kind of want to just do like a follow-up on our first day so being real as usual y'all um, it was hard it was difficult to start back up on the train of homeschooling after having like oh something's in my hair course after having like two weeks off it was hard to get started on my behalf and on Riley's behalf so when we started for today I'm like hey, let's go and she was like oh like that and that's not normally her attitude so I knew that it was gonna be kind of a push today started late we started at noon guys noon um, so like I said it's 2 30 no 2 40 I'm lying no no 2 30 I can't read time and uh, we are just kind of finishing up. She's doing an art thing. But I wanted to kind of take you through what um, what went well today and what we added and what we took away. So going over this. Um, okay. So um, we did the devotions that worked out well. What our year looked like. So right here we actually, right here. So actually what we did, we did a like a mind map. And I'm just going to show you it because it's kind of funny. Um, I put it up on our board here. So, um, sorry the lighting is going to be pretty crazy. But this is just our homeschool mind map for 2017. And what I did is just asked her randomly what she wanted to talk about, what she wanted to learn. So I went ahead and just did a mind map for her. As you see, she also learned about houses, about cars, about leaves, different insects, flowers. Ooh, focus. That says reindeer, okay? And owls in rain, okay? So that was what she wanted to learn. And we talked a little bit about each subject in terms of what do you want to learn about owls and why do you want to learn about rain, that kind of thing. So I'll kind of incorporate that. Our calendar time went pretty well um, today. I was excited about that. Our quick geography went well too. We did not actually take a break at that point. We went right ahead and did um, number sense and um, math and I actually found this printout online and I am so excited about it. Um, we're obviously learning about time so I just um, found it online absolutely free so you just cut these things out like so and then she glued it on um, and did the appropriate times. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, just to talk about um, our winter unit for January, we went through each and every one of these words and um, what they mean in the winter. So this is kind of like her board right now. What happens in the winter? And some snowflakes. <laughs> but anyways, but so these are the words that we kind of went through today. And again, I'm going to incorporate them, try to, throughout the whole month. And then... Um, <clears throat> We went through and did a teacher lesson, a teacher how to read number 57. We just finished that. And I was going to do um, a special snow art activity. And this is what I'm talking about where things don't always work out. I did not have the snowball, the um, snowballs, the cotton balls that I thought I had. I don't have them. So we went ahead and just did um, a math talk, an art talk, sorry, an art talk today. So that's what she's working on right now. We talked about a particular painting. I'm going to actually show you it right now. Show you. Okay, so we talked about this right here. Oh, my Lord. Excuse the mess. Um, we talked about this painting right here. We spent a good 10 minutes talking about it, right, Riley? We, we talked on it for a long time, huh? Okay. And what I told her to do, um, I asked her questions like, you know, if you were to name this painting, what would you name it? What and, do these girls do? And I named it. Um, what did you name it? Girls? Friends? Girls friends. of Girls are friends. Yes. Girls are friends. And we talked about, are, do these girls look happy, sad? What do you think they're doing? Are they sisters? Are they friends? That kind of thing. And she chose this girl right here to be her favorite. So she's doing a replica of the girl on her sheet right here. And I'm, are you going to do the rest of them or just the one girl? You're going to just do the one girl, rest, right? Rest. Okay, so I have to give you more paint. So that just to show you, you know. So that's just to kind of show you how our day um, kind of panned out for all those who are interested in the reality of it. <laughs> we didn't start early. We started at noon. <laughs> we didn't get to do the art project that I did plan. We did something else. 
And um, in the middle of the um, homeschooling lesson, I actually when I printed out the time stuff because I looked it and I saw it. So, um, and we didn't even we didn't do the um, karaoke break because we started so late. Um, so after she finishes her art project, I'm gonna give her some more paint. Then she can have a break and have a karaoke break if she wants to. But that's the reality. It's always changing. <laughs> It's always changing. So anyways, if you like this kind of videos, hit thumbs up. Also comment below. I really enjoy interacting with y'alls. Okay, bye guys. Hey guys, I'm back on. I know I signed off two seconds ago, but I did want to show you something I got in the mail today. I ordered this before Christmas, I think. And um, has anybody ever seen this before? They are so good. They're so cool. So we just, at the end of our day, she's we're eating lunch at 3.30. Okay. Um, but, and she has to have a tiara and a cape on for whatever reason. But anyways, um, we went through these and, um, this one, this level is the kindergarten level. And now I'm kind of kicking myself. I should have gotten the first grade level as well, but we went through these and they just asked like questions. a bunch of questions. So you read them out to her and you're your kid and they go through them and they answer them right or wrong and the answers are also given to you as well but it basically the purpose of these brain quest things um let me see what the back is gonna say um okay can you see that okay so basically it's supposed to um give your kid a jump start uh i guess I'm like not explaining that well at all and now you guys won't want it at all because I explained it really horribly but I just thought I'd just jump back on after signing off because I was like oh this is so cute so we actually went through some of those today and so I think that's one of those things to kind of add on to your homeschool day just for fun and it's not absolutely necessary she's gonna show you her ponies okay she's showing you her ponies Okay, so it's just kind of fun to kind of add on to your homeschool day for fun, not every day or anything like that. Maybe even a couple before bedtime or a couple, a couple at lunchtime or whatever because it's kind of cute and fun and they get really, like she got really pumped up because she knew the answer. She's like, more and more and more. So that was really good to see. Okay. Now for real going, I'm going to go eat my lunch. I'm having a bagel with some cream cheese and some grapes. Cheese! Cheese! I think you should sit down, young lady. She's having a sandwich with some chicken and uh, an array of um, like fruits, apples and berries and raspberries and blackberries, blackberries and all that good yeah. stuff. No, oh, actually, I do want one. Okay, bye, guys.